We make vibrators to, to vibrate anything from salt, sugar, um, powders, to concrete. From the teeniest tiny vibrator to huge ones. So, so you just add a little vibration, it gets rid of your clogs. For years I've been doing this for a long time. I'm second generation in the business. My mantra to everybody is same day, next day shipping. And if we can't ship the same day or the next day, they're going to the next person in the yellow pages, the next person on the internet. We needed to improve our on-time deliveries. And on time being same day or next day. Our people are our most valuable resource here. And without our people, we have no company. So we spend a lot of time on training, on self-actualization of of people. Every morning when we start, um, just before getting to work, we start with a stretching routine. And it helps us to limber up so that we're less likely to get injured during the course of the day. And it also presents us with the unique opportunity to have the whole team in one spot, all at the same time, right at the beginning of the day, so that we can talk about things that are going to happen today. What are the hot orders for the day? What are the customer needs for the day? We have a culture of lean here. Lean is about identifying eliminating waste at all levels from the time the order comes in till it ships out the door. An example of waste would be if somebody on the manufacturing floor is waiting for the next order or work instructions. So what we do is we have those folks in the office proactively put on boards right in the work cells what they have to do next. Transportation waste. Things have moved all over the factory. So if we can move the processes closer together eliminate the inventory in between, we're accelerating the throughput. Another waste is defects. We try to do it right the first time every time. I started here when I was 21 years old. It's a much different company now than it was then. We used to do things with the batch manufacturing. It would tie up the machine for such a long period of time that we couldn't respond to our customers well. We had customers waiting for parts that couldn't get on the machine because the job prior was tying up the machine. Now that we're into our lean transition, we've reduced lot sizes, reduced our setup times, so with the reduced lot sizes, we're much more responsive to the customer. They don't have to wait for their parts. Um, we can change over the machines in what used to take two hours. We can do it in about 10 minutes now. When I started here 20 years ago, we kept everything in boxes and bins, and you didn't always know where everything is. Now that we've arranged it to have pieces closer, everybody knows where things are, it's easier to get. The lean training, um, enabled us and, and, and taught us to broaden our scope and to look at anything out there that we already didn't have. You know, how can we answer questions quicker, um, eliminate not being able to answer questions on the first phone call. For new employees, they get an introduction to lean manufacturing and as they progress through the company, they go through a series of seminars. It gives them different eyes to actually, when they walk through the, the process, to identify the waste. We have a cellular manufacturing course. We have a 5S course, which is about workplace organization. I was on um, the first turbine team where we revamped the turbine area and learned a lot about 5S and uh, value stream mapping and uh, point of use. I'm very versatile cross-trained uh, due to Carl's uh, willingness to let us learn and keep learning. The payback for training our people and empowering our people here is huge. And the investment time that we have probably in a 40 hour work week, we have four hours of training that everybody does on the floor. So I'm constantly teaching throughout the day. I'm actually on the shop floor. I come out here about 75% of my day. Why? Because this is where we make stuff. I was here 18 years. My way was the best way. When Paul Carey came in, he did one of the other cells, and I said, I want to be next. I want to prove you wrong. He proved me wrong. I am now 50% faster than I was before. And for any CEO to think about, we have a crew of about 70 people here, to say, okay, 70 people, four hours, two hours, it's a lot of dollars, but those dollars, the payback, is huge. The best thing about Vibeco and what Carl and everyone here is, is, is involved in is that he's empowered the people to take control of the pieces and the parts that they assemble. What we designed is a, a test panel. The girl that does the switch boxes 
has to test all these panels and calibrate them by hand. And um, what she would do is take all these small wires and connect them all into these. But then she had a chance of getting a shock, and it took her a minute and a half, two minutes to do every panel. So what I did is I designed this board. We have it all wired in electrically, and all she has to do is take this board, set it on the pins, flip this switch on, she gets the power, and she control it from here, hands free of shock, and it takes her 30 seconds to 45 seconds to calibrate the board. I see the happy faces here of the internal customers, our workers, and about all the different uh, things that they're proud to show off to me as I walk through this shop and they'll grab me as I'm coming through and say, hey Carl, check out this little new gadget that I have. And I reduce this much weight. So they're really proud to show me that, their tools and how they're applying it. In a typical American company, 95% of all the activities is waste. Right now at Vibeco, about 70% is waste. That means we're six times more productive than most American companies. The bottom line is, is that we save more money. So right now we're running at about 98% of same day, next day. We're exceeding our customer expectations. We work really well together, the whole group. Anyone can step in and help anyone. We all interact on a daily basis. Questions can be answered. The more experience we get, the more we turn to each other. It's a really great place to work.